Hi, I'm Christina Beck, and you're watching Actors Reporter with Kurt Kelly on Live Video Inc. And keep an eye out for two projects, Perfection, it's a dark romantic comedy, and Dig Me, a macabre sex comedy set in Los Angeles. Kelly for Actors Reporter and Live Video Inc. from the 2013 34th Annual American Film Market, which means it's been going on both and longer you have been alive. No? Yes? Maybe? <laughs> we wish. No comment. <laughs> okay, so we're with Christina Beck and Diana Ward, and you act, direct, and write. Correct. And you give her all the money to do whatever she wants. Well, I also help her shape her story. Ah, you're a story shaper. <laughs> well, Never heard that title. Creative before. producer. I see, a creative producer. So, how did you two come together? Well, we met through mutual friends. We're also part of a female filmmaking collective oh, that's based I see. here in Los Angeles. So, I'm not really invited to that group? You can and come and listen. Uh, yeah, you can absolutely yeah. come. I can listen, I can come and shut up. And well, then you can ask questions. Okay, yeah. okay. But yeah, we were both on, the, on a panel at one of their events. Yeah. Oh, and how often do these take place? Well, um, sadly not too often because we're all quite busy trying to get our projects going and working on other things, but it's, a, it's an online resource on Facebook okay. for other females. Uh, In Los Angeles yes. or globally? Well, globally, yeah. on, okay. on, on the web. Yeah. How many members? Right now, I think we're at 800. Maybe. Wow. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. So you met through this organization how long ago? Um, a couple of years. A few years ago, years ago oh, yeah. A few years now. And yeah. so what made it click to work on the first? Is this the first project you're working on? Yes. Together, yes. yes. Okay. And what is this project entitled? It's called Dig Me. Yes. Mm -hmm. I do. And so <laughs> what's it about? Well, it's a macabre sex comedy. Oh, it's yes. one of those. <laughs> yes, yes, so many of those. Yeah. Um, no, it's actually, it's, it has a retro vibe to it. It's a very hip story about um, a young couple in Silver Lake, California, who are... I know that we're that area as well, yes. Yeah, they're trying to make their, their way through um, their sexuality mm -hmm. and um, basically need a little help. So that's Is this based on a true life story? No. Okay. Complete fantasy. Well, or something. Well, there yeah. might be some people we know. Really. Oh, yeah, I yeah. see. I see. <laughs> yeah. Who it was loosely based on. There you go. So when will this be done? Well, we are just in pre-production right now. So you're so. still putting together the digging. Yes, exactly. And we're to shoot early next year. And what's the budget of this production? We don't really want to discuss the budget, but it's a it's a ultra low budget. Okay. And um, where is the market for this? We're thinking um, mostly probably VOD, mm -hmm. uh, but we would like to have a small theatrical um, festival. It's a feel. It's going to be a feel good movie. So, so kind of like an indie film indie, distribution. Absolutely. Yes. Okay. You know, as good as you can get with an indie these days. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you know, some indies have done well. That's true. So, That's true. Uh, how many films have you each worked on in the past? Five. Okay. Um, I just finished um, a feature film that uh, came off the festival circuit um, like two weeks ago, uh, my first feature. Okay. But I've done several shorts and I've acted in a lot of other features. So. Okay. So, and you come from a line of people in the industry, I'm hearing. I do. I yes. do. My Can parents were in the business, but also I started out quite young. As a teenager, I worked with Penelope Spheris. Yes. Who uh, sort of gave me my first acting role uh, professionally and I worked on three features with her back in the day and have stayed connected to her and that's kind of how it all started. What, any that I would know off the top of my head? Um, well, her first narrative feature is called Suburbia mm -hmm. and I was in that and uh, the next one was Boys Next Door and Dudes. Now, your parents, you said were in the industry. Do you want to mm -hmm. do you want to tell us who they were, or is this going to be a family secret? <laughs> Not a secret. Unfortunately, they're both deceased. But oh, my I'm father. Oh, I'm sorry. So am I. Yeah. Yeah. It happens. Yeah. Uh, but um, they 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 made their mark. Fabulous. Yeah. Yeah. I, I I think if I ever get to talk to the big guy on this side or woman or whoever it is, I'm going to renegotiate the deal. Yeah. I like life. 
I just don't understand why you don't get out alive out of this deal. So, <laughs> something yeah. I'm thinking about. So, are you going to be collaborating on more films? Is the synergy good in the beginning here? Well, I'd like to, absolutely. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, she's a great writer, so she's got a really great voice, which is quite unique. Is this your first <laughs> time doing the writing experience? Not at all, no. I've always pretty much written my projects as really? well. Really? Yeah. So how many projects have you written today? Um, well, like I say, I just finished my first feature. This is will be my second produced feature. Oh, so feature. You, you wrote the other one also? I did, I didn't yeah. And that. I came up from a playwriting background. So this story actually is loosely based on a one-act play that I wrote quite a few years ago. There's um, the lead character which is a hillbilly sex therapist, um, was sort of... I'm beginning to think sex is a theme here. <laughs> it's two in a row now, yes. Yeah, absolutely. Why okay, not? Okay, good. I mean, as we say, we're not going to be here that long, so we might as well have Enjoy some fun, Enjoy the right? ride, yes. <laughs> so, um, and is this uh, a, a topic you're going to continue with, or...? Interaction is a topic yeah. that will definitely continue. Good. Absolutely. It's just really more about connection. It's, you know, sex is a word that gets everyone kind of it <laughs> excited, for lack get, of a better word. It does but get people's <laughs> attention. Yeah. 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 yeah, but, you know, as we know, there's something deeper underneath, and uh, we're interested in telling those kind of stories. Fabulous. So, um, we should be seeing this in production by early this early coming year, year mm -hmm. and maybe by next year at this time, we'll be talking about the premieres and the distribution. Yeah. Fabulous. Okay. Very nice to meet you, Bo. Thank you. And we'll be back more with AFM 2013, number 34 from the Lotus Hotel in Santa Monica. I'm Kurt Kelly.